usually what I use to determine which way to go is how much in the way of ductwork, piping, or other services run through the crawl space. I mean, if I got drain lines running through, if I got water pipes running through, if I got heat duct running through, I'm going to want to insulate the perimeter because then I know that I'm trapping heat in that space and that's going to keep my pipes from freezing, my drain lines from freezing, you know, and the heat that leaks off the ductwork will still be trapped underneath the floor. So that's what I use as a determining factor. Now, I always talk also about what kind of a floor there is in the, in the crawl space because you don't want to have a dirt floor left exposed if you're going to insulate the perimeter of the crawl space. You really need to put a plastic over top of that so that you can seal any moisture that's coming up from the ground under the plastic, but it also stops other um, gases, yeah, gases, like radon and uh, some of the other gases that come through the soils and can get into the atmosphere of the home. So uh, always consult a good reference manual before taking on a project like that. Make sure that you do it right. Um,